Hello again. Uh, welcome to the fourth video on uh, the Rust bindings for FLTK. So uh, this video isn't going to be a tutorial, it's just uh, the latest patch to the uh, crate, which basically added the uh, window show with args and show with env args for some specific uh, FLTK command line arguments. Uh, these are the uh, some uh, options which can be passed to uh, FLTK for certain uh, functionalities, such as passing the background color, uh, the display host, uh, drag and drop, uh, the KBD and no KBD, um, <clears throat> and to uh, modify the scheme of the application, the title of the application, etc. So. Uh, I've just taken the uh, the old uh, counter example from the uh, uh, repo, and it's basically uh, it's a simple app. Uh, it instantiates uh, an app first, and then uh, basically uh, shows a window. This is the builder pattern. Uh, it takes a size and a screen with label, and then a frame, center of the window, label, uh, the increment button, and the decrement button. And then uh, shows basically the window. So here we're using the show uh, command. So uh, <clears throat> I'm going to show you uh, how this looks like with a basic show command. So basically, I've uh, implemented this uh, uh, command line, uh, the args, uh, just to be able to uh, remove the uh, if you see this uh, small dotted line, this is because uh, FLTK allows uh, keyboard navigation using tabs or arrow keys. So you can see that it moves when I, when I press the tab button and uh, if I press the up and down buttons. So uh, you might want that for your, for your application. You might not want to. So uh, now you have the option D. Uh, the other way to remove this uh, focus, it's basically the focus uh, for the buttons, uh, is to perform a uh, to call a function called uh, clear visible focus. So button increment and uh, clear visible focus. And we use this for the decrement button as well. <coughs> So this was already available in the application form before, so now you don't see the, uh, the dotted line. Uh, another way of doing it is by passing, for example, the, uh, the no uh, KBD option to, through the command line. So we have this no KBD, and, uh, which disables the keyboard focus. So uh, we use this now. Uh, we'll, we'll just uh, remove this. Uh, Function and uh, this one as well. So now we have the dotted line again. So now we'll use the uh, the new implemented uh, method. So we'll show with and args. So there is this one. And if you run it without any arguments. You can see that there's the dotted line, but uh, if we run it with the arguments, uh, so it's a target, debug, and the app, no KBD, and you can see it's gone. So what happens if you pass, uh, for example, a wrong uh, option? So let's just pass in, for example, and you get this uh, command line message, options are Etc. This comes from FLTK itself, not from the crate. Let's say uh, you want to uh, manage your uh, uh, command line options yourself by using, for example, the uh, struct opt crate or clap, for example. There's another uh, method, show with args, which takes a slice of uh, strings. So. We can pass no KBD here. So notice it removes the env args. 
uh, which uses basically uh, the NVARX, or if you know the NVARX, so, so these are the ARGs that are usually uh, accessed using the show N with NVARGs. But this one, show with ARGs, you can pass your own uh, arguments. So here, for example, you build this. So you can see that uh, the dotted line is gone. And uh, you can pass, for example, other arguments. So for example, here the window uh, is uh, this uh, beige color or whitish color. So if you remove this and we build, it gives us the old uh, FLTK gray color. And uh, we can pass the uh, background color through the uh, arguments here. So it'll be, for example, background, white, so there. Uh, this doesn't take uh, hex values, uh, you can pass hex, hex values using the uh, application itself. And uh, that was basically it. Uh, the other options are uh, secondary background color, the display, uh, drag and drop, uh, the foreground color. And uh, you can also set the scheme, for example. So uh, let's uh, get this back. And uh, here, for example, the scheme. This is the, the uh, GTK, the FLTK uh, uh, string form of the scheme. So, uh, you know, from here, for example, we use app, app scheme, GTK. So if you remove this, for example, and let's remove the uh, GTK buttons here. So if we use this, if, uh, let's remove this first, for example. Um, so we get the the square uh, or rectangular FLTK base uh, scheme, and uh, if we pass, uh, let's also note this. So you get the basic uh, FLTK uh, uh, appearance. So let's return the uh, scheme here and also the background color. So background and uh, this is this should be scheme. And here, white. So it gives us again the uh, GTK buttons, which are a bit rounded, and the uh, white uh, background and you can see when I press the button you get selection colors these are also uh, using these uh, methods here button increment set, set selection color color green and uh, button decrement set selection color color red you can remove these uh, if you don't want them and uh, that was basically it uh, for the uh, latest uh, update uh, uh, 0.7.21 hope you enjoyed and uh, hopefully I'll make uh, more videos soon bye